from Scottsdale. <laughs> you can be from Cyprus and anywhere else, but yeah. you, you better get your feelings out your pocket. Yeah. As long as you live, somebody gonna hurt your feelings. Yeah. They, 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 they hurt your feelings at Wendy's when they give you cold fries. <laughs> He said, all that way, a knowledge chip. Now, now, I need to find a crowd in here this morning. Guess what? You tried doing it on your own this year. Just this year. Just this year. Not that. Just, just, just this year. Wait, wait, wait. Did you, you tried doing it on your own, and you still hadn't gotten what you want. So, so let, 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 me, let, let, let me give you a recipe. He, he said, first of all, acknowledge him. And he will direct thine path. Now, if you need that, we used to sing this song in the country talking about, let Jesus. Well, you know. That's that, that Sister Hatch, y'all. She, she knew what I'm talking about. Tell me, let Jesus lead. He's a mighty good leader. And let me tell you something. I don't know nobody in here this morning that if he ever led you, he ain't never led you wrong. Even if he leads you into some trouble, he's a God that can get you out of it. Anybody in here, can you just go and thank God for God leading you? I want to say that for a moment. You went a different way home. Yeah. Oh, you know what I'm talking about. Every now and then you go a different way home, man. And yeah. wrong side. Yeah. If you wondering yourself, why did she go that way home? And many times he leads you a different way because there was an accident on the other side. He said, I that you are my child and since I'm leading you I'm going to lead you in a path that you will be saved I want to make one more example he ever told you don't say that I know you didn't obey our nation huh I don't even want to get the other part. I really get that long and I appreciate that. He ever told you not to think that? Yeah. Lord have mercy. But you said, I'm going to think it anyway. Yeah. And, and he, he lets you live on so much conviction. Lord have mercy. And see, see let me, let me, I was teaching last week about uh, you, you speak death and life through your words. And, 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 and sometimes you got to be, be careful what you say. Let, 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 me, let me get these couples or these significant others that's in here. Guess what? Let's stop telling them, I hope you die. I, you know, I, I don't ain't no good. Don't come on. I mean, uh, oh, come on, boo. I mean, I mean, oh, Lord. Chain, oh, Lord, good God. I ain't never going to never, you ain't going to make it without me. And, and your life ain't going to never be. That's foolishness. Look, look, you ain't God, Junior. Matter of fact, some folk would make it better without you. Stop thinking you all of that and being some three snap snaps in a circle and a bag of shit. Somewhere to go today. <laughs> One of my workers said to me recently, Say, I'm mad and I'm over with. For the 
sense of sacredness. Isaac Whitney. Me and you quit. Give me a bag. Give me a proxico. You know this kid that right? See, see, stop speaking stuff into existence. If you don't want it to happen. See, when you start acknowledging God in everything you do, in everything you say, some stuff around for you when you start trusting in him. Oh, let me get out of this place. Then he says, go back to verse 5. Now I told you I'm walking back. Trust in the Lord, not with your head. I'm in the Bible. With all of thine heart. Lean not to thine Oh, don't understand. Y'all need to write this down. Write it down in your mind or something. Yes. Trust God yes. and leave the consequences to Him. Yes. Yeah, y'all missed that. Yes. Yeah, have I told you this about half hour? Yes. Well, don't do it. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, trust God. Leave the consequences to Him. In, in, in other words, Pastor, what do you mean? Guess what? I made up my mind, I'm going to just trust God through this terrible situation. God, watch this. God, I don't know how it's going to turn out. But guess what? I'm just foolish enough to trust you. All right, I'm going to get the right side. Trust God. And leave the come what? Sometime when you pay your tax, you got to trust God. And see God working your life. I got a couple of you babies in here. God is blessing you because of your faithfulness. Come on, help me in here. Anybody, can you just give God a Holy Ghost praise in here? Because of how he is blessing you. Somebody ought to just go on to and thank you. Try
from January. <laughs> I got the right Man, when I look back and how many folk I prayed over this year, you, you, you ought to thank God that God showed you something. It wasn't because you've been so good. It wasn't because you've been so kind. But thank God for faith. You should have been fired on your job.
deal with depression. When you couldn't lift your head up, there wasn't enough Prozac to take you. And you look back. I got the wrong church this morning. Let me get somebody here that knows something about just looking back. When you had a midnight experience. Thank you. 